What the bloody balls happened? What? The lamp. What? <laughs> Guys, welcome to Ocean City Racing. Now, no. This is not a big AAA budget racing game that I normally play. This is something that's on Steam for about three quid. Now, I'm just going to be playing through this and seeing if it's actually worth the three pounds I paid for it. Um, it looks basic, but one thing I wanted to say straight away is when I actually got onto here, first thing I noticed is color depth, 16 of 32 bits. Since when is that a thing anymore? I don't even know. And I put it in windowed in 1080p, and my monitor is 1080p, and it put it lower than 1080p. Not a great start. Control list. Actually, let's have a look through this. See what the uh, the buttons are here. Some sort of strange ticking when I went on free... Ra oh, here we go. Okay. This doesn't look too bad. Alright. There's even litter on the floor. Detail. Alright, let's have a look around the city. That is a really nice detailed car right there. That's a Galado. And there's a guy walking around. Hey, buddy. Alright, mate. Why am I shorter than you? Are you just gonna- you're just gonna pass- okay, bye. This really reminds me of Los Santos, like San Andreas Los Santos. Just that lighthouse there, I don't know why. And that is- Why have they got a- why have they got a Greggs? I- why have they got a Greggs? Look at this Jeep, can we actually get inside this as well? No, we can't even get in this. This guy is looking like he- he definitely drives that car. Well, maybe he doesn't. Maybe he just stands next to it and stares at it all day. Like, I don't understand. These cars are, like, all really shiny and this is really detailed. And I don't know what the hell that's supposed to be. Can we actually get in this one? Oh, my God, we can get in this one. So the less detailed cars are the ones we can get into. I say less detailed. They're more detailed, but they don't have as good textures. It's like, why? Why? I want good details and textures. I'm guessing that's supposed to be some form of Camaro. Definitely some some form of Camaro. And there's a scooter as well. Can we get on that? No, we can't get on the scooter. That's a shame, because I'd like to drive the scooter as well. Anyway, let's jump into this car. E. Whoa, hello. Did you hear that? Can I run him over? No, we just we're just gonna drive for Okay, cool. Hey, we can knock down the signs and stuff. It's not too bad actually. It's not too bad at all. Anyway, let's see. Oh my god, it's like test drive, it doesn't turn. Now, I'm quite annoyed. Oh, wait, there's a drift button. It's not a handbrake, it's a drift button. Or maybe it is a handbrake. I don't know, it's either or. Is that an Aston? Oh my god, that's an Aston Martin. Let's get in that. All right, Aston time. Annoyingly, I can't turn off this music. Like, I thought there's no option, there's no button. This music is ridiculously loud, and I can't turn it off. I don't even know. Oh yeah, NOS. Look at that. I think, guys, that I'm going to have to say this game may actually be better than Rivals. <laughs> I'm going to put it out there. I think it may actually have more than Rivals brings to the table. Look at this open world. So detailed. I can drift around everything. Can I actually drive up the wall? That is incredible. Can you do that on Rivals? I don't think so. That's a Porsche. Give me the Porsche. Well, it looks like a... It looks like a... I don't know what it looks like. It's a Porsche MX-5 combo, right? Is that, is that fair to say? I don't even know. Hey, people. How's it going? What? Well, speak up. I can't hear you. I want to listen to this conversation. Hello? I think she can see it. I don't, I don't even want to know. I don't want to know. There's literally nothing else in this section of the map. I just keep hitting these lampposts. I don't even know. Whoa, what the hell? Why did it turn on its own? Jesus Christ. Literally nothing in that section it just goes round in circles. I don't even understand. Why Why is this a section? Let's just, let's just go through here. Oh, for God's sake. I tell you, this is what Next Generation is about. This is what everybody will be playing in a couple of years. Indie racing games that have no detail in anything. It's just driving around freely. I say that, actually. We haven't tried the race mode yet, so I can't say that. It might actually, it might actually be a very good racing game. We'll have to see. That's a diner. I'm going off road. Is it as open world as Horizon 2 and, and the crew? Let's find out. Well, that car did get a little bit higher than I expected, but we're not getting any further than that. What we got here? What the hell is that supposed to be? It's like an R8458 
Italia? I, I don't know. They all sound exactly the same, so it doesn't matter anyway. And they all drive about the same speed anyway, so none of it matters at all. I don't know. Why did I spend £3 on this game already? Like, I don't understand. So basically, the aim of this game is to drive around in these cars and do nothing. Still a better progression system than rivals. <laughs> Wait, is this some kind of jump? Is this some kind of jump? No, it's the shitest bridge... Use, most useless strike bridge over I've ever seen in my life. I don't understand. Let's just uh, Let's see what's around here. I don't know. Can we actually go anywhere from here? If we go up this bridge. Oh my god I just took someone out. Take that burnout. Don't need you no more. We've actually just found the only version of a game you- Oh my god! Okay, you don't need burnout or need for speed anymore. They've just been replaced by this game. Oh for god's sake. I'd like some gas, please. I can't use the handbrake when I'm using NOS. I, it's a, press it and it goes. Hey, I want some gas, please. I can't move their cars. I wanted to smash them out of the way. Is there actually another city we can go to? Holy crap, this map is actually not too bad at all. I think I may have underestimated this game. Maybe it's... A... Okay. <laughs> Big, big motherfucker! Do they still try and keep under control as soon as you flip back over? No, he's, he's just disappeared. Okay. He's respawned. Is that supposed to be some sort of Evo? Let's just push him over. There we go. He's done. Despawn. Yes. Yes. <laughs> the car killer has been born. Bloody hell, he's almost flipping over him. Shunted. Can you, can you let me pass? Let me... I didn't even touch you! Oh, I'm gonna get sued for that. Holy crap! We can drive a bloody quad bike! Oh my god, it actually has a different sound. Has it got NOS? Oh, yes! Look at him, he's... Is he just looking at you? Yeah, his eyes just follow the, the screen. That is absolutely terrifying. Speed! I don't think this is going to go as fast as the cars, to be quite honest. Let's just... Alright, sir, please stop. Oh my god! I demand you to stop and hand over your vehicle. Or not, just... Yeah, smash into me like that, that's fine. Alright, so the free roam's not great. That might just be that's all, all the bad parts out of the way. You know, the, there might be a completely different map idea for the time trial and race mode. Let's go to race mode. Oh, it's actually got a career progression. This! Might be bloody interesting. We'll have to see this one. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, damn. It's time for underground racing. Here we go. Yes. Look at this. High intense racing. Oh, my God. What the hell just happened? Did he actually damage a light? Oh, my. Oh, my God. They've actually got damage to the lights on these cars. Incredible. Let's see how this AI is. Oh, for God's sake, what the hell was that? Yes. Come on. <laughs> what am I doing with my life? Stop it. Jesus Christ. They're just shunting me. They're worse than bloody drive clubs, AI. I say that's bad. I say that in a bad way, but... Shunting in drive club is okay. This, they, they spin you completely. Nos time. Come on, we're going to catch up to him. How is he so far ahead? He's like... All the cars go about the same speed. Did he just... What the hell happened there? Well, I'm not going to complain. I'm in first place now. Yes. That's a wall. Do we even need to follow these checkpoints? We just go around them. Yeah, we don't even need to follow them. We just... It just gives us a basic idea. Okay. All right. One lap complete. One lap complete. I'm sorry, but I've already taken them on the first lap. I'm not going to complain about long races, but I will complain about the AI not actually being any competition at all. I span out. That's a tree. What the hell? Do you know, we might just have a relaxing drive through the city now that we're in first place. Like, I've, I've left them completely behind on the first lap. I'm really hoping it gets more difficult than that because they're not even close. <laughs> Guys, I honestly think I've figured out why the music is playing and not disableable. Because the engine sounds are completely off. Literally, you'll be like breaking through a corner and the acceleration noise will still go. 
If you can listen in, just like literally just listen for a second. What the balls did I just hit there? Jesus Christ. Listen in for a couple of seconds and you'll definitely hear that the engines is completely off. Nice try though, guys. Nice try. Oh my god, I've that's don't use the handbrake. The handbrake is not good. Okay, I've just come round. I'm on my last lap, and the AI has been stuck there. I don't understand how he got there, but he's literally not budging or restarting or anything. You know, I'm gonna make this this point every single video here. Still better than Rivals is AI. Yes, across the line. Look at that. We won first place. We can play the next event. Restart on main menu. We're gonna go to the next event. All right, here we go. Next race. This time, we're in the Aston-looking car. And we're going again. What the balls was that? I just hit the woman. Guys, move. High-speed Aston coming through. No. Okay. Okay, I, I think there's about three songs on the game. I literally think there is. And that's going to be very annoying because you can't turn them off. Why? Please. Don't torture me this much. Don't tell me he's going to stay there. He's going to stay there. For God's sake. Is this just like... This is like a low-budget burnout, literally. With... Yeah, because they've got, like, reimagines of cars. Like, quite literally, you can tell that's an Aston Martin, though. Like, GTA does good recreations. Sometimes you can't really tell they're exactly the same. But this game, you know exactly what the bloody car is. You're going to get sued. Well, you might do. I don't know. Depends. Sorry, mate. I'm not really... Look at that, Lambo in the rough neck and neck. Lambo has been spun out, and I've not almost flipped him over. What the bloody hell is this? Why, why, why am I still playing this? Time to take down the rough. He's literally just stopped there, for God's sake. Move! Did I stop him? Oh, no, he's, he's turned around and he's continuing. This guy is not going to give up anytime soon. And I probably will give up before he does. Now... I'm all for relaxing music in a racing game or like lower tone music. But if all of your songs are like relaxing, chill, free roam music, you've got a bit of an issue if you're trying to make a racing game. If it was just a free roam, sure, go ahead. But it's not. Where the hell is he going? <laughs> Hello, sir. I'm going to take you down. Whoa! He's got better brakes than I have. What the bloody balls happened? What? The lamp? What? Excuse me? And now I'm being shunted by the Porsche. Okay. The AI has literally been ported from Rivals. I take that back. What? I got taken by the Lamborghini. That flipped me over. How the hell did that even happen? He was going the wrong way for the whole race. Okay. Next event, I guess, yeah. Oh, yay. I can't wait to do another event. Here we go. Oh, wow. This is going to be such a fun race with the AI being all over the place. And I just can't wait to get on with the... Oh, fuck this. I quit the game. All right, let's give the time trial a new go. Let's let's see what the time trial is. My guess from how that was just set up saying new game is it's going to be the race mode, but in time trial form. No, it's something completely different. There you go. It's actually going to be time trials. That is pretty impressive. Not going to lie. Here we go. That's right, guys. Going to show you how it's done. That song is the right choice. Take the lead. Here we go. We've just got to do a nice quick drive from... What the hell? We've got to make sure that we get all the corners correctly with no controller support whatsoever. It's going to be absolutely beautiful. Here we go. Look at that. Dominating so far. Target time is 2.25. Do you think we can do this? I, I don't know if we can. We'll have to give it a go. It's worth a shot. Turn. The cars don't turn unless you use the handbrake. That is something you must learn. Using the normal brake? Uh-uh. Nope. Handbrake is the brake. The brake of the... I... Oh, for God's sake. Come on. All right. Going to fly past this pedo van. 
Fly past his taxi. Take him down. Downtown. Oh. All this game needs is a cockpit view and it will be racing game of the year. I'm sorry, woman, but there's your free cola because I hit the machine. But the machine takes no damage and neither does my car. Isn't this city just a wonderful place? Yes. Yes. We're going to do it. We haven't got long left in this time trial. Do you think we can do it? I don't know. We had a massive spin. And I've spun it again. I honestly can't give words to this game. I've got 30 seconds left to complete this. How how long have we got? There's no mini-map. The, the, is this the finish? Is this going to... You! <laughs> oh! Um... Okay. So, I can see the ambition behind it. Making an open-world racing indie game. I applaud you for that. But what I don't applaud you for is the game itself, the outcome. Like, I know you don't have a big budget and stuff. But what the hell is this? Like, the AI doesn't work. The, just make a top-down game, please. Let me know what you think of this game if you want to actually see me play any more of this this thing. And if you want to buy it on Steam, I'll link it. I don't, I don't recommend you do. But you can buy it on Steam. Gets flagged by the company. I don't know. We'll, I'll see you next time, guys. Peace. <laughs>